Good afternoon. My name is Ninesh Pinto, and this study is about a stress assessment tool to assess the COVID-19 pandemic-associated stress levels amongst medical graduate students in Sri Lanka. The COVID-19 pandemic has brought about a new norm. However, it impacted the student population, which is one of the most vulnerable groups. This study aims to develop a symptom score to assess stress levels among students, in this case, overseas medical graduates preparing for the licensing exam in Sri Lanka, and to assess correlation of the symptom score with the standard stress scale. The data was collected using a digitally administered analytical cross-sectional survey. The students were grouped as awaiting the very next examination, X, and sitting the exam in a year, no X. The prevalence of eight stress-associated symptoms were among students was assessed. The symptom score was developed and, a, and an association was assessed. 326 students participated and the response rate was 74.4%. And 246 of these students were awaiting an immediate examination. 208 were aged between 26 to 30 years and 236 were females. Anxiety was the commonest among the study group and difficulty falling asleep was the least. A symptom score of X was 3.10 plus or minus 1.80 and no X was 2.09 plus or minus 1.92 and significantly associated with X. Out of the eight uh, symptoms, as, uh, out of eight symptoms assessed, five were significantly associated with X and they were headache, anger, anxiety, irritability, and boredom. Using symptom score, an ROC curve was created and the symptom score of more than two out of eight had a sensitivity of 62% with a specificity of 67%. The symptom score has a high reliability. Cronbach's alpha was 0.705 and showed a significant correlation with the perceived stress scale. In conclusion, this symptom score can be, used to re can be used reliably to screen for and prevent stress prevalence in similar student groups who have been deemed uh, vulnerable due to the pandemic. Thank you very much.